Lang Lois Vital Nutrition Center. Okay, uh, again, Epic Times, buy that paper. It's a great paper if you want to hear both sides of all issues. It's a good article on vaccine autism, but that's not what we're talking about today. We're continuing on the ultimate guide to kicking sugar. Now, we are not talking about fruit, and we're not talking about honey. So we're not talking about good natural sugars. Those are actually really good for you. But we're talking about white sugar. Very important to get off of white sugar. And this article is all about the power of stevia. It's a green leaf plant. There's the leaf. You can actually you can actually buy it locally. I've seen it at Stein's little stevia plants, and you can actually here they talk about uh, making your own tips for growing at home. And the beauty of stevia, I've actually been using stevia for 40 years before it was legal. When it was illegal, I was using it. Uh, I was breaking the law apparently. Um, of course, anyway, so stevia. This is the one I like here. Now's better stevia, zero calorie liquid sweetener so it's the it's a leaf and uh, this one i actually even like better the glycerin one the organic glycerite stevia it's got a really nice flavor um, it's good now amazing here the article talks about uh stevia's ability to um lower your blood sugar. So um, it actually has anti-diabetic properties. Modern research has found that stevia exhibits anti-diabetic activity. It increases insulin to, that's it, and reduces your body's sensitivity to it or what they call insulin resistance. So when you consume this, your insulin levels go up to help bring your blood sugar down and your body's ability to utilize the insulin and the sugar into the cell because the cells, it doesn't, doesn't happen in the blood. The blood's a carrier, which is why um, rather than blood work, we prefer hair testing. But anyway, you want to get the sugar into the cell where it can be burned for fuel. So stevia is great. You can, I put it in my, actually in my coffee. Now I started doing that. Um, so yeah, there's it. There it is. You don't need much sweetness, two to 300 times sweeter. It's anti-inflammatory and amazingly, they've been using it in Paraguay, South America, um, for 1500 years. So 1500 years of use, supposedly People have used it safely. So there you go. There's a great sugar substitute you can use to sweeten things, sweeten desserts. Uh, obviously, you'd have to change the ratios if you're baking and using this. I've been putting it in my coffee, but if you want to sweeten uh, yogurt, I've been uh, making homemade yogurt with good, clean milk, and uh, I've been sweetening it with this. So there you go. Your health is your wealth. Take care of your health. Your, your whole life will go much better. You'll be in a better mood. You'll be happier. You'll enjoy yourself. So thank you. I'll see you in the next video.